Good morning, it's so messy, I don't want you to see that. Hey guys, welcome back to another video of mine. Today is Saturday the 24th, 24th I believe of April and it is lunchtime, it is sunny and as you can tell from the title of the video, this is going to be a video where I have an afternoon tea from a box. Basically, with my back condition, with my leg condition, honey, it just basically causes really bad sciatica pain in my legs and it's been really really unbearable for the past couple of months um, so going out the house is really not an option for me or going far is not an option for me so my friend is coming over originally this video was just meant to be me on my own so if my pain did strike I could cry and no one would be there to see me however I wanted a friend there because I've been locked up in the house for too long and the world's opening up again and the UK's opening up and restrictions have been easing Touch would they stay like this and I feel like I need to do stuff to keep myself happy mentally because otherwise I'm gonna it's gonna be like a double whammy of just a double whammy so I ordered this afternoon tea box for two this is a vegetarian box from Piglet's Pantry now I saw Piglet's Pantry mentioned on Grace Booth Grackle her channel and she ordered some for her friends and I wanted to give it a go. I'm gonna insert some footage here of yesterday of me unboxing it because it came and I needed to organize all the cakes and the fridge stuff and the stuff that needed to be left out and everything so I kind of just unboxed it. So I'm gonna insert that here so you can have a look. So yeah, that box is £30 for um, two people, however I managed to get it for £25 I believe altogether, um, including postage and packaging. Uh, including postage and packaging, it's 35, 35 I believe on the website, but I got I, I found a deal on Groupon and it came up to £25 with postage and packaging, so always search, I never pay full price for anything. But I'm going to link their website below, I'm very excited, it's a very big, like, there's a lot in there, so very very chuffed. Need to go and set up, so I'm gonna bring you along. I just thought it'd be fun, so I hope you enjoy. My friend's gonna be here in about 10 minutes and I'm still not ready, so nothing new there. Okay, so this is what it looks like so far. I don't know how well you can hear me, but this is literally just a basic basic setup. We're waiting for all the oven things like sausage rolls and quiches and all of that. So here we have, as you can see, we have fruit, blueberries, strawberries and grapes. We have these lovely cakes that came in the package, clotted cream that came in the package, the teas that came in the package, cold water, just exciting stuff. Look how nice this looks. Under the tree. I'm glad I'm not doing this on my own because it'll be a bit sad, but you know what, I still would have done it. I'm gonna do a quick outfit um, of the day. We've got this Ayats Franz grey hoodie from Urban Outfitters, got my ASOS shorts on that I always wear that have been with me across the world, Southeast Asia, also to, um, where's my mom Sarah? So to Europe and then everywhere else, and then these Adidas super cool. There we go. Nice white sneaker to add onto my collection because my Nike Air Force ones are absolutely wrecked because I stomped in a swamp. Just waiting for my friend Emily to come. I think thumbnail getting is the most awkward thing you could ever possibly do. Also, I was meant to film this on my new camera, however, I started setting it up last night and I'm overwhelmed. There is a lot of settings and not enough brain power in this little head, so I decided to abandon that and we're using my normal cam. Camem? Canon G7X. My friend is here. Just saw her car drive past. Alright, well, I'll go and greet her and she'll see you in a two secs, two ticks. Tick tick. I'm very excited. For the price of this afternoon tea in a box, you get quite a lot and it looks really premium quality and like high quality, like ingredients wise and I'm pretty chuffed, but we'll see. After we eat it, we then know like a full rounded picture. But yeah, let's go get my phone, so let's go. So now we've got the scones, scones, jam, vegan, veggie, ve veggie sausage rolls, cakes from earlier, the veggie quiches and the veggie scotch eggs. I've never had a veggie scotch egg, I've had a normal scotch egg and they were nasty. Fruit. Um, yeah, that is everything. Mm -hmm. 
So that might be better, there we go. Oh, sugar. Please, may you pass me the, I don't want to shake the whole table. Some more too? Yes, please. I'm gonna just do a little. It looks yellow on camera, but this is the veggie scotch egg. Uh, it's green and eggy. It's nice, mm. but I wouldn't choose it. Yeah. If I was given that, I'd be like, finally, yeah. So now I have a carrot cake. We've literally eaten basically everything. Everything was delicious. We had the scotch eggs, um, sausage rolls, and quiches. Quiches was very nice. The scotch egg had this weird filling in that I didn't really like. Um, and then the sausage rolls had peas in, which, so what I put it, quiche, sausage rolls, scotch eggs, and Emily put it. Quiche, quiche. scotch eggs. So, just flip the bottom two, but they're all right. It's good. I'm gonna eat the carrot cake and I'll let you know what it tastes like. Three hours later. Hey guys, we have finished our afternoon picnic. That was a very long afternoon picnic. Really enjoyed just spending time with my friend. She's going home now. I just wanted to give you a quick review of the afternoon tea in a box. Didn't really like the scotch eggs. Personally, I didn't enjoy them. Like I said earlier, me, I gave my ranking and my friend Emily gave her ranking. We're probably gonna try a different box next time if we were to order from here again. The cakes were really lovely. The cakes were quite thick as well, like you saw from the video. Scones were really nice, really sweet. They broke off like a biscuit. Good balance between soft and hard. Really like that. The jam was really good. Overall, very, very, very impressed. Sorry that this video isn't too long, but I kind of just wanted to do a quick like, review video. Originally, it was just going to be I ordered a afternoon tea for one because I was bored, but I actually ordered an afternoon tea for two because I couldn't leave the house. So I hope you enjoyed. Um, I would recommend. I'm going to leave the link down below. They're good. They make good gifts as well. They make amazing gifts. If I were to receive one of those for my birthday or something, I'd be really chuffed. Like we said, we're probably going to try something else, and hopefully, when things open up indoors, we're going to try and go for a real afternoon tea because I've never been for an afternoon tea properly in my life. But this kind of really curbed that desire. So yeah, I'm gonna end the video off here. I hope you have enjoyed it. If you have, please leave a like and don't forget to subscribe. Instagram and my other social media is linked down below. Other than that, I shall see you guys in my next video, which will be on next Tuesday. Till then, take care, stay safe, and I shall see you guys very soon. Bye.